So, the last few years, most of us changed our lights to LEDs, and today I will compare cheap to expensive LED light bulbs and explain quality differences and simple modifications you can do to totally avoid any potential hazards. So starting, I got two 3 watt E27 bulbs with cool white light at 6000 Kelvin. The left one is a cheap no-name Chinese that cost me only one buck while the right one is branded and cost around 7 to 10 bucks. When it comes to light quality, good warm light bulbs differ a lot, but as you see, most times it's not the case when it comes to cool daylight. The build quality of the cheap ones varies to the factory, but overall for the money you pay, they are just fine. What I consider the main difference is that usually cheap bulbs use many individual small SMD or even regular LEDs. The better designs use one or more high power LEDs or multi LED boards. The LED drive is the most significant part of the bulb. The good bulb has a transformer based driver. The cheap bulb has no driver at all, it is powered by a bridge rectifier and a current limiting resistor. This design is acceptable, however this specific one has very poor isolation between high and low voltage sides. In case of LED failure, it might lead the current limiting resistor to a meltdown. To prevent such kind of risk, do the following modification, but only to plastic light bulbs that you are sure that not get hot to the touch when working, otherwise you might make the bulb overheat. Open up the casing and stuff the circuit with just a little tuft of rock wool insulation or perlite. This is how you will prevent it from any danger of fire, and pretty basically this is how you can use safely an LED light bulb that is cheap enough to make you think about if it's safe or not. That's all for now, thanks for watching and I hope you find this info helpful. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe.